Two Wayne County students and their mother died in a crash in Tennessee last weekend, leaving a huge void in their community. Today, both students were honored by their classmates who released balloons and are raising money to try to help the family. LEX 18's Carolina Buchek has more in tonight's big story at 530. These tiny feet didn't run around the playground like usual today. Instead, the fifth graders at Monticello Elementary School hugged and cried as they released yellow and green balloons, saying goodbye to their classmate, Ivan Mateo. He just always had a smile that was infectious almost. Ivan, his 18-year-old sister, Emily, and their mom, Josefina, died in a crash in Tennessee over the weekend. Today, fifth graders wore shirts with Ivan's name in his favorite color, green. And his teacher read one of the last assignments he wrote. Jesus is such a great friend. A few hours later, more balloons were handed out. This time, it happened at Wayne County High School, where Emily's friends, teachers, and fellow ROTC members said goodbye. She was a very high-ranking member, um, especially in Color Guard, uh, and she just loved that program, loved her country, and uh, loved God. To help the Mateo family, the students are also selling bracelets at tonight's football game. I think we've raised about $1,200 in the last couple days. And in addition to those bracelets, this is the banner that the team will be running through at tonight's game and if you look over here in this corner it says hashtag Mateo Strong. Covering the news in Wayne County, Carolina Buchek, LEX 18.